Saturday, September 21st was Pennsylvania Derby Day at Parks. Fans lined up early for the big event that featured two Grade 1 races. PA Derby giveaway caps and the sweet sounds of the Uptown String Band were ready to greet the patient fans as they waited for gates to open. The first race of the day wasn't a horse race, rather won by the fans to snag a perfect seat to see the stars that shipped in to parks. The most happening spot may have been the picnic row, where racegoers could grab some pen horse racing swag and apparel and enjoy a variety of live music. Family friendly activities at the track included pony rides for future race riders, horseshoe decorating, and bounce houses for the kids. It was easy to find terrific food and plenty of fans cooled off with some soft serve ice cream. Before you knew it, it was time for the big races. This year's grade one cotillion is absolutely loaded. I mean, this is actually the best group of three-year-old fillets. I'm gonna say this race has ever seen. Very likely, you got Serengeti Empress in here, Breeders' Cup winner Jay walks in here, Bella Fina's in here. Everybody showing up for this race. Top connections, race about to go off. My top pick's Bella Fina. I still like this filly. Hopefully, I can get her home in front. They come to the top of the stretch, and it is Dorada. Dorada has taken the lead. Straight Bennett has made a big move on the far outside. They're coming down to the final furlong. Dorada, here comes Straight Band on the outside. And Straight Band has come from far back to take the lead. Dorada now second, but Straight Band is beginning to move away. And this will be a signature moment for Straight Band. She's seven to one and she's got it. Straight Band wins the cotillion just over two at the end. Fans made their picks and it was time for the Pennsylvania Derby. My name's Eva and I want to wish Laura Will good luck for in the Pennsylvania Derby. A stellar field of six took part in this year's event. Fun to run and improbable. Backing up just a little bit and they're off and improbable did not get a good break. The improbable did not get a good start. So spun to run on the outside. War of Will to the inside. Mr. Money right with those two. And it looks like Mr. Money, after Improbable got that poor start, will inherit the lead. And Gabriel Saez has a handful. In fact, he has two hands full of Mr. Money as they go into the first turn. War of Will will ease his way to the outside. That will carry Spun to run three wide into the turn. Improbable has now moved up fourth. He's trying to get off the inside for Mike Smith. And then it's Math Wizard and Shanghai Superfly. Mr. Money went that first quarter in 24 and 2. And he'll lead the way to the back stretch in front three quarters of a length. War of Will will prompt in second. Another length back to a three wide spun to run. He's racing third by two and a half. Improbable finding his time with five eights to go. Just edging up just a little bit now. Improbable within three lengths of the lead. The two long shots at the back. Shanghai Superfly and Bath Wizard. That's a very slow half mile. 49 and three for Bath Wizard. Going to be a sprint for the last four furlongs now. They head to the far turn. Mr. Money in front three quarters of a length. War of Will continues to track. Spun to run coming up three wide. Improbable. Waiting for his cue to go. Math Wizard trying to get involved on the outside. So they round the far turn. War of Will coming up to engage Mr. Bunny. Spun to run is three wide in it with a chance. Math Wizard trying to spring a big upset on the far outside. Improbable saving ground all the way looking to come through on the inside. It's Mr. Bunny off the turn with the lead. Mr. Bunny in front. Spun to run on the outside. Improbable up the inside. War of Will in between horses. Math Wizard on the far outside. What a finish in the Pennsylvania Derby. Here comes Math Wizard on the far outside. Math Wizard. Mr. Bunny. Math Wizard on the outside. Math Wizard. Math Wizard. Yes, sir. Math Wizard. Sorry to one upset winner in the Pennsylvania Derby.